Hi Gandhi class, welcome to your second design technology lesson this week and our learning objective for this lesson is can I evaluate my own invention? So Dr George Scott says, all inventors and designers evaluate their products. This is because it helps us to see what we have done well and what we can do better for next time. Please answer the questions below. So I'm going to get you to fill out your own evaluation form of your invention. Now I'm going to speak through each part and then I'm going to show you how to answer it before you have a go at doing it yourself. So the first part says on a scale of one to 10, how happy are you with your final design? And you need to circle the number you feel about your design. One being not very happy, 10 being very happy about it. The next part says, what is the best part of your design and why? So you need to pick the best part or parts, there could be more than one, but you have to tell me why it's the best part. How does your design, how does your invention meet your design specification? So with this part, you need to look back at your design specification. Have a look at what you wrote there and see if your invention meets that design specification that you wrote. And the last one, is there anything you would like to improve in your design and how would you make it better? Now, this is where you look at um, and critically evaluate your design and you have to think about what is not so good, what didn't go so well and how could you improve it or change it for next time? So using my final design, which I've put the picture up here, I'm going to show you how I would answer these questions and then you're going to have a go at doing it yourself. So the first one, on a scale of one to 10, how happy are you with your final design? I'm going to give it a, mm, I'm gonna give it a nine. I think it's quite good. I think it sets out what I want to achieve, but I think there's always room for improvement. So I'm gonna give myself a nine for that. Okay, and then what is the best part of your design and why? Now looking at my design, I think the best part is, I think the rollers are really good because looking at my other designs from um, last lesson, my design too, I think that could have been a little bit dangerous. So I'm glad that I went with the roller design. So I'm gonna say um, the best part of my design is the rollers because I think they will be safe to use and will provide um, the user with great comfort. Okay, so there you can see I have used that because, because that word explains my point. So whenever you see a why question, always use that word because, because that word is an, explain, is an explaining word. Okay, how does your invention meet your design specification? Now you're gonna to need to go back to your design specification and see how it meets it. So I'm gonna say for this one that it does meet the design specification um, because, I have used the materials in uh, oh, the materials that I listed and it meets the needs of my target audience. So my target audience would be people who, you know, might have some back pain and they need they need the, the mattress massager to help them. Um, it is also safe to use. So just bringing that point back again, I made sure that I chose the roller design because I thought that would be safer to use than the water tank design. So it's also safe to use. Um, and so my target audience, oh no, and it's also safe to use um, and so this does meet my specification. Okay. Is there anything you'd like to improve about your design and how would you make it better? So this is where you need to list things that, you know, didn't go so well or didn't turn out just how you wanted it to and how you could make it better. So looking at my design, I think that something that I could do to make it better would be to add, I would add some more rollers maybe just to really ensure that people are getting that 
massage that they want. So I'm going to write to improve my design. I will add in, um, I could add in more rollers to improve user experience. Now, with each of these, I have answered with a full sentence. So I'm expecting you to answer the questions with full sentences as well. I don't want to see something like um, rollers are the best part. I don't want to see that. I want to see the best part of my design is the rollers because and then explain. So I need to see full sentences from you, please. OK, your task, you're going to now evaluate your invention by answering these questions below. So please pause the video here so that you can use this sheet to help you evaluate your design. And then once you have done that, please make sure you upload your work to Tapestry and I'll see you next time Gandhi class. Bye.